hey guys welcome to my channel today i will show you how to add additional nick card on the linux vm on linux server okay so before that i want to check the connections so there are two connections so we are going to add additional connection so um before that we need to get into the vm workstation there I'm not sure whether we can add online resources right click and get into the settings okay so in this you can see the configuration of this VM so the memory is 1 GB processor is 1 40 GB of hard disk I assigned to this and similar way so we can click on this network adapter okay you could see it's connected with the NAT used to share the host IP address so it's connected state so similar way so I will add one more resource here click on add okay whatever you want like if you want to additional hard disk you can add it and ploppy nowadays we are not using no issues uh, the requirement is to add new NIC card so I will click on NIC card adapter network adapter finish okay so additional NIC card is arrived network adapter to NAT so I will click on NAT only which is working on earlier network adapter same configuration I am using here as well so I will click on ok ok so it's automatically shut down now it's uh, I think so it's not rebooted let's see yeah it's not rebooted so guys uh, we'll check the connection status now list of connections um, so there are two connections now so which we recently added the network adapter so that device name we want to know to assign the new IP so we'll check the <coughs> connection name device name so device name is ENS37 so I'm going to use this device uh, for new IP connections so I will clear my screen so <coughs> now we'll create a new connection connection add type Ethernet if name so if name my if name is the new device name is ans37 okay so i will make a connection name as system uh, system eth1 okay and uh, just enter it yeah so now our new connection uh, device is successfully added to verify it just run this nmcli connection so first one is the active which okay it's it's taken new ip so so automatically it's taken okay uh, 130 ip we didn't provide it here anywhere uh, uh, before if you see here it was totally free okay when we added new uh, uh, connection with the connection name so directly it uh, taken random IP next available IP okay uh, in in um, uh, in day-to-day -day scenario so you need to add the IP manually so I will show the command so I will not run why because it's so randomly taken next IP since I am using a virtual machine so you can use this command nmcli mod um, our uh, example yeah uh, our uh, connection name is system eth1 and uh, we are going to add ipv4 method and manual and ipv4 addresses 
and now we need to give the um, 26.131 okay and we'll give 24 okay if I get if I press enter so it will make the connection then then we supposed to do an MCLA connection app system with one so th this is the process um, in 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 uh, normal scenario but um, since I am using a virtual VMware machine so it's randomly taken the IP so hope you got the hope you hope you got the idea on this like uh, once you add, added the additional card how we can make it up with the new IPs thank you